What is up, everybody? It is me. Fullback, fullback pitch running. Sorry about that long pause. I don't know why. It's up, but it is me. Fullback pitch running. And that's resume for another episode of LA Noir. And I think I got it. Let's see. He's our man, but we should see what he has to say. Okay, that's... Good, okay, good. Yeah, before my did this, there's a, a recap. Jacob Henry had a violent argument with his wife last night. He's looking more and more likely. Ah, uh, for my money, if the broad keeps the house looking like that, she's probably deserved it. The skipper says bring him in and keep the hacks off her backs for a while. Because they, I started the video before. Keep on straight. And it was Fine by me. So it ain't the werewolf killer after all. Good to see you've come to your senses, Cole. I always said work the evidence. I only stipulated a connection to the BD killer as an avenue of investigation we should leave open. And as far as I'm concerned, it still is. Here's the recap. Stop. Turn back the other way. And I don't want to annoy you guys with that. So yeah, here we are. That was you guys. No, no, again. Mine is cold. What the heck? Take the next left. What next left? Oh, I guess. There. I love the snow. I really do. You're making a right at the next intersection. Wait. What is that? Left or right? I'm so confused. And I'm so happy that my semester is almost over. And sad, too. And some of them miss my writing class. That's the only class I liked. <laughs> the only. Sorry! Take the next left. I'm gonna miss it. Oops! Hey! hey. Okay, at the next corner, hang a right. Oh my god, you gotta get me. God, my friends are so funny. They really are. They're yeah, a good group. Still think that I have a group in college, it really is. That's the most important thing that you have to have. Okay, Phelps, we're going hard. You Why do I have a gun? How? Oh. oh, we have to. No. You Jacob Henry? Yeah. Who's asking? LAPD. You're under arrest for the murder of your wife, Celine Henry. Murder? Celine? Save the dramatics oh, oh my for God. RKO, pal. You got bigger problems. What the hell are you talking about? You come in here, you, you tell me that Celine is... Take a seat, Mr. Henry. She's... We're going to have a look around, I... then we'll talk. Jesus, I'm sorry. <sighs> oh, okay. I thought it was a cutscene. I get even the slightest hint that you're a flight risk. When did you last see your wife, Mr. Henry? Last night. Uh, I went to see her. We talked. Things got a little out of hand. I left. You don't remember what time you last saw your wife alive? Look, I'm sorry. I left. Maybe 9 p.m. Might have been a little later, but right around nine. Why did you kill her, Jacob? Things will go better if you come clean about it. That's a lousy thing to say. I never gave up on my wife. Why did you pause there? No! I don't believe you, Jacob. I think you didn't have the guts to do it I yourself, so you had someone else do it. Cop. You want to back that up with something, Big Mouth? Huh? 
and it means do that. I've had just about enough of you. So who could have killed Celine? Where did she go last night, Jacob? A bar, I suppose. Look, I don't know. There we go. We get the impression that Celine liked to live the glamorous life. How did she end up with a hump like you, Jacob? Celine was one of the first woman pilots. She hung out with movie stars and royalty. But when she came back here broke and struggling, she married a mechanic, put a roof over her head, food on the table. Not glamorous, but the best I could do. I'm not ashamed about that. So you can prove that you came back here after you left your wife's place? I came back here. I was here all night. Start work at 6.30. I'm not the going out type. I'm not too sure about this. So you were here, tucked up in bed, while someone was out there beating your wife's brains out. That's all you've got? Talk to the bartender at the Bomba Club. He'll tell you. He called here last night, and I answered the phone. We're still going to need you to come downtown, Mr. Henry. We can get this all down on paper, Jacob. How you got fed up with your wife and how you figured killing her would bury all your troubles. Kill my own wife? She was a loss of the trap, and you just couldn't stand it anymore. Shut your goddamn mouth. <laughs> so now you're going to tell me you loved her? Ah, the DA goes all gooey over remorse, Jacob. <gasps> Not this again. Hey, don't you dare unbalance me. Let's just do that. You're awful hot under the collar for an innocent man. What's this bunker? Oh, oh my God. in and get a squad car dispatched and check for messages i'll keep old slugger here company and yes let's go check the goddamn messages what's that a book huh what's your heart uh, scary about book seems irrelevant well mm -hmm. whatever ideals whatever that says interesting Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Phelps, one, two, four, seven. How can I help, Detective? I need a patrol unit to transport a suspect back to Central. Certainly, Detective. You have a message from the coroner. Do you wish to be put through? Yes, ma'am. Carruthers. It's Phelps. Completed the autopsy. Several wounds to the head from a blunt metal instrument. Closest match would be a socket wrench handle. So the cause of death was the blunt? No, the blows to the head surprisingly were not fatal. Death was from hemorrhage and shock from the fractured ribs and multiple injuries caused by the stomping. Anything else? He's some kind of sex fiend. The tissues of the anus were bruised about one eighth of an inch, but no trace of semen in the anus, vagina, or stomach. Thanks, Doc. Operator, give me R and I. Any word on an owner for that vehicle? License was two boy eight eight nine nine. Yes, Detective. The plate belongs to a brown nineteen thirty six Pontiac. Registered owner is one Alonzo Mendez of four oh two South Fremont Street, apartment sixteen. Thanks. Any other messages? One, Detective, from Captain Donnelly. He wants any and all suspects returned to Central. Interviews to be set up immediately. Got it. We're coming in. He's going to jail. Another one put away. 
and got busted, buddy. Now you gotta pay the time and do the crime. I don't know. That fit in the right moment. Brother said she took a real pounding. Maybe if he had been a little firmer in the beginning, he wouldn't be in this situation now. I imagine that Neanderthal routine is a big hit with the ladies, Galloway. Women love me, Phelps. I have no complexity. They know exactly what they're gonna get. Oh, guys. Keep on going through here. I was watching Luke Cage earlier. That is right. Luke Cage! Really? Kidding me? Just go easy, oh, Phelps. Is my the best show ever. And also, up ahead, you turn left. The slowest show ever. Slower than The Walking Dead. I have to say. I have watched that before. I watched Luke Cage. You need to turn left at the next Copy junction. That. I like Luke Cage. Tell me down below. It's a very horrible TV show. I'm almost done. Well, I'm watching this episode of Punisher tonight. I love that show so much. I can't believe. I don't know. It's an awesome show. Love the Punisher. We have a firm lead, Captain. Now, you question my judgment, Cole Phelps. No, sir. Good. I thought not. Jacob Henry is a subsister pushed around by his wife. I think with the right kind of persuasion, he might be prepared to seek absolution. Are you prepared to show him the error of his ways? Yes, Phelps. I don't think he's our uh, man. Galloway agrees with me. Don't drag me into this. Rusty is a practical policeman. A bird in hand is always worth two in the bush. Let's liberate a confession from poor Jacob and the public will sleep easier tonight. Run along now, folks. I've warmed them up nicely for you. Okay. And Jaden says, what I say is that weird, but this guy said that's the most weirdest thing ever. But anyway, my friend Jaden, he's all. He really is. What do you think? There's only so far we can get leaving Jacob the stew, Phelps. Let's get back in there and take another run at it. Doesn't look good, Jacob. You're in a big jam here. You lie to me, and I can't help you out. Do you understand me? Yes. Oh, Jaden, you're funny. I never showed you him, you guys. Well. Oh, yes? No. No, I didn't. Wow. I have to show him to you. He's a really funny kid. What do you do for work, Jacob? I'm a mechanic. Engines, differentials, transmissions, that kind of stuff. So you have access to tools? Yes, I do. Your wife was brutally beaten with a socket wrench handle, then stomped to death. How do you think that looks, Jacob? I was home in bed. Really? You were at home in bed while your wife was putting out to some stranger? What kind of man are you, Jacob, that you allow that? You son of a bitch. You got no right talking about my wife like that. Your marriage was over. You took her in and she threw it back in your face. You didn't go over there to hurt her. It just got out of hand. It's not how it was. Uh-uh. It wasn't the first time you hit her, was it, Jacob? This might sound dumb, but sometimes I had to defend myself. She was strong and dangerous when she was drunk. You did it. Everything points to you. What does Tex mean, Jacob? I, I don't know what you're talking about. If you didn't kill her, then who did, Jacob? 
I don't know. I... I don't like to think about it. I know she met other men. I know it. Maybe it was one of them. I don't see any way out of this unless you give us something. Phelps. You failed me, son. We have another lead, Captain. This guy Mendez could be our man. I hope so, Phelps. I really hope so. I'm deeply disturbed by your style of police work. Okay. So now I... Do we go back in there? Saving, what's it saving? What's that mean when that? What's that mean when our boss says that? Where's my partner? You think those vice boys get any on the side? We can still pull down oh. a conviction for the skipper if we chase down this Mendez guy. Oh. I'm so confused. <laughs> Straight on. Uh, speaking about Rob, um, you know how it snows in GTA every Christmas? Okay, did they just listen to me? That's just creepy. Watch out! So yeah, me and him are gonna make a video. I, I might. Alonzo I might Mendez. Do Sound like a man who moonlights as the werewolf? Don't sound like a man I'd let my daughter anywhere near. You've got a daughter. Spend enough time drinking, Cole, you'll find yourself with any number of things you don't want when you're sober. So that's why you never sober up. Exactly. I might do a stream or a video when it snows in GTA. Send me down below or on the side. Which one do you like to prefer? Stream or a video? With me and Rob, uh, I'll make a video. Because we've been thinking of a video to do, and we don't know what to what to think, what game to play. Or tell me down below what game you like to me and Rob to play. I think the game decides Grand Theft because we stop. Mendez, apartment sixteen. Because that game is like boring, getting boring. I used to miss it. Apartment 16. It's so boring because we're doing the same thing. Here, the apartment's if up on the top floor. If we all had a supercomputer, it wouldn't be boring because the Grand Theft Auto Online on, a, on the computer would be so much funner. I'm trying to install LSPDF Force there. And it always, I don't know what's wrong with it. And my eyes itchy. I want to install it so bad. But wind war is like so confusing. Tell me down below if you guys use it and tell me the steps of it too. How to install uh, LSPDF4. I don't know why I do it so bad. Living. Twelve. Twelve. Ten. Don't bother knocking, just kick Whoa, the door okay. in. Oh, yeah! Take a look around and see what you can find. with horses. Very suspicious. Is this really the room? 
Why is the room so low? This this kind of reminds me of the um Mafia 2 apartment. Wow, that's weird. <gasps> My name's Steam Hyde. What was that? Nothing significant. Consistent with Celine's injuries, and the blood can be typed. Brothers could match the color and brand of the body. We have the murder weapon. We better get Pinker down here. Why keep it? Why not throw it away? Think these clowns are geniuses? Thank your stars you caught a break. Captain Donald will begin to like you. Hey! What gives? LAPD, you're under arrest. Do not lose that son of a bitch. Oh, God. I'll go get our wheels. Oh, you're running. Mendez, stop right there. Go, 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 go. Gotta stop right now, buddy. You don't need to do this, Alonzo. Yeah, you don't. Come on. Don't leave without me. Where are you going? Get in and drive. Oh, good. I thought you were leaving without me. Watch out, people. Very important investigation here. Oh, yeah. Oh. What the? Watch out, watch out, watch out. Whoa. I got an idea. Yeah. Get him next to my window, Cole. Okay, then. Keep me alongside his vehicle, and I'll stop the son of a bitch. Okay, don't you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hit him, Cole. Spin him out. I'll try to shoot out his tires. Wish oh. me luck. Car born for ya. Oh, I didn't mean to run you over like that. You're under arrest for the murder of Celine Henry. Put your hands where I can see them. Yeah, mister. Mister, mister, mister. That's quick. That was a quick card chase. I ain't saying a goddamn thing. Okay then. You did a grand job, lads. Phelps, that's quite a way to acquit yourself in your first outing as a homicide investigator. It seems the city has a new and vengeful guardian. Considering the evidence against your suspect and the thoroughness with which a report was compiled, I foresee a safe passage through the courts, and the DA agrees with me. Brutality on a scale such as this deserves retribution. The people and the press of this city demand it. That was quick. That was quick! Okay, what did I do? Okay, I'm gonna do, um... We are gonna do a part two of another crime scene. 
So, let's I do another crime scene. Well, quick timing there. This pain to cool the love of Luke Cage. you pump through my veins, cause I'm burning. I'm burning up for you. Okay, that was a weird intro. The golden batter buttery? Battery? I don't know what that says. Why does every crime scene start with the car? Really? Another day in another office. Galloway. Got it, Skipper. Yeah, I'll bring him. He's my partner, after all. <laughs> That's funny. What have we got? New case. White female dumped in plain sight in the grass at the end of Hill Street. Hacks are all over it. Captain's trying to fend him off. That sounds awfully similar. The first rule of police work is make no assumptions until you've seen the evidence. Skipper wants you to have your newspaper face on, colleague boy. I think I know the place where they found the That's lady. Funny. It overlooks Sunset Boulevard. Let's I'm a go. College boy. And a murder college boy. That's the guy from the paper. Oh my god. Solve that big Yes, case. I did. Stop asking about it. It's really annoying. This guy's got a screw loose. Oh, I've got, I've got, okay. Come on, come on. Watch out, partner. You did a decent job on the Henry case, though. Not bad for your first time at bat. Thanks, Rusty. But don't go getting ahead of yourself. That's one clearance under your belt. Now it's a new day with a new dead lady that needs our attention. You don't need to turn here. You no know assumptions until we see the evidence, right? Right. See, I knew you were fast in the belt. You might get along after all. Okay, at the next corner, go right. God, I'm so excited for it, guys. The Hundred. I love that show so much. I love it. New season's coming out next year. I love it so much. I love that show. Head right. Now, boys, boys, you know as much as I do. I'll be holding a press conference once the autopsy is being completed. I have two of my finest investigators on the case, fresh from bringing down the sword of justice on the crazed sex. Captain, of aren't Mendes. there similarities between this murder and the murder of Celine Henry? And of Elizabeth Short, for that matter. So you don't matter. believe there's a crazed sex killer at large boys, preying on women? Boys, boys, be sensible. We have the greatest police force in all the world, but the greatest scientific investigators are our disposal. How can any killer continue to be that? Be advised. We keep the gas chamber at San Quentin primed for the sons of Cain who continue to believe they can take a life in the city of angels. Yeah, right. Any new leads in the Dahlia case? Run along, boys, and let these officers get to work. We have God's work to do here, and it can't be delayed. What do we have, Captain? 
Another woman sacrificed. Speak to Carruthers. I want daily reports, gentlemen. Shouldn't you be working? Detective, I was first on scene. You find her, Gonzalez? Oh, Not me. Got Family out for a stroll. Right? I was first reporting. Can you show me the body? It's under the pepper tree, this way. Can't be much help to you, Phelps. Here she is. Yeah. Here she is. The stomping angle in the Henry case, was it reported in the press? Sure was. Every detail a copycat would want was there in the story. Oh, God. What's this mark? A cut on a finger. Fourth finger, left hand, a wedding or engagement ring, violently removed. Looks like she was tied up. It does at first, but that would leave a mark on her other wrist, too. I think her watch might have been torn off. We did that, we did that, we did that. Look at your mark, it's very distinctive. I'll do some comparisons back at the lab and get back to you. Anything else? What are we looking at here? Similar remote. To what? The Dahlia? I don't think so. Celine Henry. That's a closed case. This is probably another sad sack who lost his temper with a broad who wouldn't put out. Are you a suspect, Rusty? Watch your mouth, Phelps. All I'm saying is we've got enough to do without reopening closed cases. Talk me through it, Mal. Severely battered, on display. Footprints would indicate that she has been stomped. Size of the footprints would seem to indicate a smallish men's shoe. What size shoe did Mendez wear? You finished? No, I'm not. At a glance, I would say strangulation is the cause of death. I'll need to do further tests for semen. Angry boyfriend. If they were married, they'd be at home. Not humping out here in Lover's Lane. Okay. Well, we have a name. Can you run Deirdre Muller by R&I? Back in a second. If the motive was robbery, why not take the money? Detectives. R&I says a Deirdre Mahler of 130 North Bonnie Bray was reported missing this morning by her husband, Hugo Mahler. What'd I tell you? Let's grab the husband, take him downtown, and work him over. We can have this wrapped up by lunchtime. What about not making assumptions and going on the evidence? I'm getting tired. And the end didn't really get there.
there might be some play in the boyfriend angle. I thought we were on our way to lock up the husband. If it doesn't work out, then. Deirdre Muller has suffered enough. More than enough. You shouldn't make disparaging well, comments about her, her without even the slightest inkling of what she was like. She was a woman, wasn't she? Now, around about my third divorce, I realized women might not be the pure okay. angels we have. If we survive this, it's going to be a miracle. Take the next so one. So fast, guys. Don't make any insinuations about my wife. Hey, she's a woman. She's the mother of my children. <laughs> you're a father, Cole? But don't tell me your eye don't bend. Okay. Jesus, no. Did not even expect that was gonna happen. Da 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 da. I need a car. Mother's coming in tonight. I borrowed that car and bought the FBI. I'm sorry, sir. Police officer. I need your car. God, you know. Slow down. I really didn't expect that. I need you to take a left at the next corner. Okay, at the next corner, hang a right. Up ahead, you turn left. Okay, so when we arrive, I'm gonna end the video here because, like I said, I get tired really fast. God, the day can get you tired, and the weather too. Tell me down below, do you guys get tired? Okay. Doing that. Oh my god. Breathe. No. Breathe, damn it. These old cars can really take a beating. Take the next right. Watch it, will you? Okay, at the next corner, go right. And let's see, I'm gonna do a little shortcut here. Do a little shortcut. Turn back, we're going the wrong way. Ah, uh, no more, guys. It's left at the next break intersection. Comes, I'm not gonna be so tired like this, just that college that like, make me tired off the work because I get home pretty late. Like really late. So I'm gonna end the video here. Okay, so if you guys want to see more videos like this, just hit that subscribe button and that notification bell too. It really helps out. And I'll see you guys in the next video or live stream. Tell me down below when uh, Rob gets his headset. Tell me down below what do you like better, live stream or a video in Grand Theft Auto Online when the snow comes. I'll let you guys know when we're gonna do it. And and what and if you want to see my hey. Cole, are ending the moving. video here, and if you want to see my funny moments in real life, um, I'm gonna put my Snapchat down below. So yeah, see you guys next video. Have a nice day or night. Bye. See you guys tomorrow. Subscribe. More videos like this.